Uh, today I'm here with uh, some more questions about uh, calculating volume of prisms and uh, today I'll be going to discuss a question uh, which we ha which will contain a table with uh, some values missing and we will be filling that values with the uh, with the help of the formulas and calculation so let's begin so here is a question that uh, this is a, this is a prism with a triangular base as you can see that ABC is a triangle and it is written here as well that area of triangle that means this is the base and we need to calculate the base area and then we need to multiply by the height that is CD to obtain the volume of the prism as uh, we have the values given here that is AB that is the height of base areas height uh, then BC which is the base areas base the, uh, uh, by the help of height and base you can use the formula of the area of the triangle to calculate the area of the base that is a triangular base and then you can multiply it with CD that is the height of the prism to calculate the volume but this part is divided into two parts first you need to calculate the area and you need to fill up these values and then you uh, can move to the volume and uh, these are the four cases and we will look at them one by one so let's begin with part A in part A we have been given that AB is 3 cm that is the height of this triangle and then uh, we have BC that is 4 cm and then CD we have 7 cm so first of all we need to calculate the area of triangle ABC and uh, in order to calculate the area of this triangle we need to use the formula of area of the uh, area of the triangle that is 1 over 2 base into height that is this height into this base multiplied by half to obtain the base area and we can uh, write the value of area of triangle ABC then we can multiply it with CD to obtain the volume of the prism as I have done here that is volume is, uh, volumes formula is base area into height and we first uh, first of all we have uh, solved for area of triangle ABC that is half into 4 into 3 that is base and height for BC and AB and we have resolved it to get the uh, answer of the base area that is 6 cm square after that we have multiplied this value with 7 as the volumes formula is base area into height and base area is 6 whereas height is CD 7 cm we have multiplied both the values and got the answer as 42 cm cube uh, let's move to another part here it is AB is given 9 cm that is the height of the triangle then uh, BC is missing that means we cannot calculate uh, the area of the triangle without the base but in this particular case the area is given that means we can use the formula of area of uh, the base area uh, half into base into height and we can calculate this base because uh, with the help of this uh, formula uh, and the areas dimension given after that we can uh, after uh, getting the uh, answer of BC we can use the area of triangle of ABC and the CD that is the height of this prism and then we can calculate the volume of prism easily uh, so let's look at the solution that is area of triangle ABC is half into base into height now area of triangle is given so that is 63 I have substituted that and uh, then B is missing that is BC that is the base of this triangle and height is 9 cm so I have plugged in the values 2 is dividing here then uh, there that it will be multiplied and then uh, 9 is multiplying here uh, on the other hand side of the equal so it would be divided and when we will resolve it we will obtain the value of breadth as 14 cm so the uh, so the length of BC would be 14 cm in this case and then we can uh, multiply the area of triangle ABC that is 63 by 11 to obtain the volume that is base area into height base area is 63 into height is 11 and we can get the answer as 693 cm cube so let's look at part C in this particular case the a the height of the uh, base area is missing the height of the triangle is missing other than that the area is also missing that means we cannot resolve 
uh, for the area directly because the height is also missing and the base area is also missing so we cannot work upon the height too but in this particular case we have been given the volume of the prism if the volume of the prism is given we can use the formula volume of the prism first to obtain the base area or the length missing but uh, in this case the uh, the length cd that is the height of this prism is given to us and the base area is missing whereas the volume is given so we can use the formula volume of prism that is volume is equals to base area into height we can plug in the value of the volume that is 72000 and base area is unknown and height is 300 cm uh, centimeters so here it is multiplying on the on the left hand side it would be divided and then after divi division we have obtained the value as 240 cm squared that is the base area after obtaining the base area we need to calculate the height of the triangle so now we have the base area so that this will be something like case uh, before we did before in part B that uh, we have used the formula of area of triangle ABC half into base into height now area is given to you that is 240 and uh, base is 15 that was given earlier and height was missing so we can resolve this and get the value of height as 32 centimeters so let's look at the uh, the last part that is the D part in this particular case we have been uh, we have we don't have the value of CD and we don't have the value of area of triangle uh, base, base area or area of triangle as well so we can use the fir firstly we can use the formula of base uh, base area of uh, and to calc and we can calculate the area of the triangle that is half into base into height and this is height this is base so we can use the formula and we can obtain base area that is 95.94 cm square in this case after obtaining the base area we have the volume and we need to calculate the height of this prism that is the length of CD so we can use the uh, formula of volume of prism and uh, we can put in the value of area and we can calculate for the height so here volume is equals to base area into height volume we have substituted it as 38,376 is equals to 95.94 into height that is a base area into height and when uh, it is divided on the left hand side we have obtained 400 centimeter that is the height of this prism that is the length of CD uh, these were the all the parts so now we have plugged in the values and now we have uh, full filled this table and uh, we have obtained all the values so this is how we op uh, obtain the values when one of the value is missing in the calculation of volume of prism or maybe the base area so i'll be coming up with the next video soon so stay tuned